My primary responsibility today is uh, the model building and analytics for all of our global international locales and the science and engineering that accelerates our delivery to our global customers. So my team is working on two emerging technologies. One is acoustic event detection. It's a technology that enables Alexa to be able to understand audio beyond speech and language. The second area of technology my team is developing is about recognizing emotion from speech. Um, so when you think about customers interacting with Alexa, occasionally Alexa may make a mistake or make mistake multiple times. We want to give Alexa the ability to perceive that frustration to make the interaction more natural and uh, bring the conversation back on track. So I'm in, a, in, I'm in an organization which is called uh, so this is Secure AI Foundations. So here the idea is to basically to try to like democratize uh, AI across Alexa. So this means basically providing everything that other scientists and engineers and uh, TPMs and whatever across Alexa need in order to deploy and to use AI models. I basically look into new algorithms to improve language understanding, multimodal understanding and action prediction for conversational systems and also response generation. What we do is, is we work on question answering. So we want users to ask us questions and we'll understand the question and then we'll also find the answer and return the answer in, in a natural way. My role is I lead the team of technical program managers for dynamic routing in Alexa. It's, in a nutshell, dynamic routing is the system that decides given what you've said and what, what you've requested, what is the best uh, action for Alexa to take in response. We can now produce synthetic speech, and we can sort of change the degree of happiness to sadness. So once we realized we can play around with emotions, we actually said, let's choose an iconic style like a newscaster and see if we can produce that. And sure enough, we could. We are really just starting out in understanding how to use the potential of, of this neural technology, this ability to be able to dynamically adapt during a conversation is hugely important. We still have a lot of work in terms of uh, making a speech recognition technology better and better in very noisy and challenging scenarios. The other aspect is, you know, uh, the multilingual and code switching aspect of a speech recognition. In markets and locales like India, uh, people are super creative in terms of how they mix different languages like for example, Hindi and English. And that, you know, there is a huge complexity over speech recognition. And we, we, we are hard at work to still solve such problems.